Fight fans, fight fans, fight fans. This is Kurt Deville with Counterpunch Boxing News, and I have some new news concerning Javante Tank Davis, Ryan Garcia, Golden Boy, PBC, Oscar De La Hoya, Al Heyman in the place to be. Bars, get this. PBC sends a new revised contract over to Golden Boy to inform him that he will become the A-side if he can defeat Javante Tank Davis in their much-anticipated first rumble. Wow! Big news. Why? Confirmation, confirmation, confirmation. Confidence, confirmation, confidence, and more confirmation. That's what I see from the PBC. Why? Because anybody that makes those type of concessions for another fighter these days, as much as disappointment as appointment as we had with guys like Crawford and Spence and, you know, and, and, and a lot of these other fights, I say advantage PBC. Thank you for doing that because it just shows confidence and it, it, it definitely shows confirmation that they are sure that Javante Tank Davis will beat Ryan Garcia. Now, to me, I look at it 55-45 in a favor of Javante Tank Davis simply because he's just the more, on paper, he's the more powerful fighter, okay? But don't get it twisted. You know, you ever seen Floyd Mayweather, Diego Corrales? Diego Corrales was that guy, 29-0, and no loss and no draws with 33 or 34 by KO. Coming in there with Floyd Pretty boy, Floyd Mayweather, 24 wins, no losses, no draws, with 17 got by, by KO. So they thought, well, okay, if anybody was going to get knocked out, it was definitely going to be Floyd if Floyd get caught. Floyd didn't get caught, and he dropped and caught Diego Corrales five to six to seven times until it got embarrassing, and Diego's father pulled the plug on that fight. This fight could happen that same way. And if it does happen that same way, you already have Ryan Garcia primed to be a star, you know, the next Golden Boy. He's from Golden Boy Promotions. If, despite all the trash talk, all the mierda, all the stuff that you heard between Ryan Garcia and Oscar De La Hoya, if Ryan Garcia can beat Javante Tank Davis, he will ascend, he will skyrocket, okay? He will be on the moon. He will be like Hancock, okay? He will be like one of those guys when it comes to boxing, simply because he's already had, he has, he already has the platform. He has the following. And, you know, and I see him doing much more, you know, from the catch weight, going to 140, going there, doing your thing, then going to 147, doing that thing, just like Oscar De La Hoya did in his heyday. So I see him, the next golden boy in, um, um, in, in the making, simply if he can beat Javante Tank Davis. But hey, that's, uh, easier said than done. But again, uh, I do appreciate PBC and it just shows you that they're scrambling to make fights because they need to keep that network alive. And I don't blame them. I don't hate the PBC. I just know things weren't right. But I think that when you, you acknowledge things are not right in your outfit, that's signs of improvement because when you're in denial, you may go out of style bars. But anyway, you guys tell me what you think of this new development between Ryan Garcia, Javante Tank Davis, A-side if winning, A-side if losing. But anyway, you guys tell me what you think. Please subscribe. And you guys been counterpunch. Peace.